Hey brothers and sisters, hope y'all had an amazing day today in Jesus name. Welcome back to the channel. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notifications button for future videos. And also don't forget to leave a comment. Today, I'm gonna be making a video about music and why I make a video about music. Cause the thing is, every believer and unbeliever needs to be aware of what kind of music they listen to. Cause we are, we, we are not just what we eat, we are what we consume. And especially Gen Z, we we need to be our generation. Clearly, me needs to be aware of this, cause I know some kids kids in our generation be doing crazy stuff because of the type of music they listen to. And before I do go deep into the topic, I'm gonna state this Bible verse, and it says in Proverbs chapter four, verse twenty three, is we are to guard our heart with all diligence. Brothers and sisters, y'all need to understand how powerful music is, and it's so powerful that it's able to unify the people of the most high as it has the power to make you happy sad and upset and the devil devil knows this very well he's aware of this because originally before he, he fell obviously he was in charge of music there was instruments inside of him he was leading the worship he was leading the music until one day he decided to start a rebellion and gather one of the god's angels and therefore he ended up getting kicked out of the heaven and now he's basically the quote unquote God of this world. And what Nick is he he uses to push out his, his agenda is using using the music industry to push out his demonic agenda. Using these artists and rappers of this who are who are of this world, who are chased after the things of this world. And what you need to know about music is that music usually has usually always has hidden messages. And every time you listen to the music with these hidden messages Eventually, it's going to be a grain to your mind, and it's going to be a grain to your soul. And eventually, you're going to end up acting upon that hidden message that the music is talking about. And you want an example? Let's say you're lis listening to music, and it's talking about sex. And, and a type of artist who usually talk about sex is Megan Thee Stallion, Justin Timberlake, Nicki Minaj, whatever artist you want to, want to think of. Let's say they're, they're singing a song about, about sex, and this is your first time listening to, to, the, to the song. And at first, nothing happens, and and you continue listening to it because it sounds good. You get that, you get that dopamine rush, that dopamine hit. And eventually, over time, as you continue to listen to that music, and you eventually, for some reason, you end up becoming lustful, a very lustful person. It, lost a person and you end up fornicating or worst case scenario scenario or the r word someone if you know what i mean and that goes to show you just how powerful music is and the thing is no wonder why you're so sad and depressed and miserable and lustful and no wonder why you're far away you don't have a purpose no wonder that you're far away from your mission. Worst of all, you're far away from the most high. If you wanna be more cautious of the type of music you listen to, first of all, you need to read the lyrics. Let me say that again. Read the lyrics. And why is that? First, you need to, you need to go through the lyrics and you need to be aware of what you're listening to because these words are being ingrained into your mind and your soul. And ask yourself when you read through the lyrics, is this glorifying God? Is this glorify anything positive? Is this talking about anything, glorify anything that that guy hates? If you ever answer no to one of these questions, then don't listen to the music, period. And second, don't don't focus on how how good the music sounds, cause niggas that's how the enemy gets us, gets us. That's that's why so so many people end up end up getting acting upon upon the hidden messages because they're more they're more focused on how good the music sounds and and the enemy is aware of this and the thing is these rappers and these artists i'm it's not me giving them credit or anything but they work very hard to make sure they pr produce the best quality quality music like i'll be real honest with you to make sure they it sounds good and make sure it's best quality that so that so people are able to listen to it that people are attracted to it and the sounds and and the music that, and since it sounds good people end up getting seduced by seduced by the by the by the music 
just like so many men nowadays are lust are very lustful are getting seduced by the idolatrous idolatrous woman which which her lips are as sweet as honey and words were as smooth as oil just like music and me personally i listen to to anime music gospel music and i listen to secular music depending on what they're talking about and if it's not glorifying god i don't listen to it any is that if it's glorifying anything negative i don't listen to it and to include music is very powerful and you you are not you're not you are not what you just eat you are what you consume and this is just this this doesn't just apply to music this applies to anything entertainment tv books any kind of entertainment anyway that's all i got I do pray this video helps you on your walk with christ i do pray this that this video helps you helps you with your music habits to help you edify the most high I do pray this this may, helps people open their eyes as well to to the to the things that's going on around them. Don't be malicious. Follow Christ.